Prime Minister Son Sai Sipendon and other officials paid a working visit to Pung Sali on Sunday to learn about developments in Nyot U district. Provincial authorities are working to improve crop cultivation and yields, as well as the farming of livestock and the provision of services. Residents of Nyot U district in Pung Sali province are growing more rice and other crops in line with government advice, as well as raising livestock for sale to ease their poverty and improve their quality of life. The general situation in the province was reported to Prime Minister Son Sai Sipandon and other officials when they paid a working visit to Pung Sali on Sunday to learn about developments in Nyot U district. They were received by the Governor of Pung Sali province, Mr. Kampui Vanasan, and district and provincial officials. Dr. Sonsai recommended the cultivation of more crops on a more organized basis, saying the farming of commercial crops and cattle and planting of more trees would be a better substitute for the cultivation of opium poppies. He advised local officials to set up development and road construction and to allocate land for specific uses. Provincial officials should estimate agriculture and forestry work to raise more people out of poverty and increase the rate of development. <laughs> Provincial authorities should improve infrastructure and overhaul their planning and budgeting methods, as well as encourage more investment in the province. Authorities were also advised to improve services at the international Lantui border crossing with China. Officials from the Ministry of Finance, Ministry of Public Works and Transport inspected services, fees, and the processing of vehicles crossing the border and held talks with local authorities on the various problems that had been encountered. The Governor of Nyot U District, Mr. Somvang Somvilai, reported on the progress made in social and economic development in the district, which is in the far north and is 93 kilometers from the provincial capital. The district covers 3,105 square kilometers. Some 97% of the land is mountainous and 65% is forested. The district has 22 villages where 52.73% of families have risen above the poverty line and 11.54% of families have been described as developing. The governor of Nyot U district spoke of the need to pave roads with asphalt, build more roads and embankments, improve the water supply, build a bridge across the U River, install more irrigation and make other infrastructural improvements. An official from the International Lantui border crossing reported on developments at the crossing which opened in 1989 and connects to China. On Monday, the Prime Minister and his officials visited Pong Sali district where they met with residents of Nongkinali village, which contains 119 houses and 534 people. All families moved out of Gumai village, which they were displaced by the U River electricity project. 